Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a haul video that I'm super excited about because I bought something from the, the Louis Vuitton store that I've been wanting for like over two years, so I'm really excited to show you guys that. But I'm also excited because I feel like my channel has been a lot of tutorials and I've seen some comments saying like, are you going to start doing like um, hauls or tags or anything like that? And yeah, I definitely want to mix my channel up a little bit more. I love doing nail tutorials, like that's my absolute favorite thing to do because it's just where I am the most creative. Um, but I know a lot of you guys miss like the talking kind of videos, so I miss it too, honestly, because I like to talk and I get to show a little bit more of my personality and people aren't yelling at me to shut up and get to the tutorials, so it's kind of nice that I can just take my time and do a haul video and talk to you guys as much as I want to. So that's what I'm going to do today, and it's actually a pretty small haul, but I definitely want to show you what I got at Louis Vuitton, and then I also have some things I got from the, my local beauty store that I want to show you guys, and I want to show you what's in my what I got in my Ipsy bag, because I actually got it a couple of weeks ago, and I haven't had a chance to show you those things, and I want to show you that, and I think that is pretty much what this haul is going to be, but I also want to let you guys know really quickly that on my vlog channel, which is Miss Jen Vlogs, I will link that channel down below, later today I'm going to be putting up a like home decor haul. It's really just a beauty room haul because it's all things I purchased for this room, which I am going to be t doing a tour of this room really soon. But um, if you want to see a couple things that I purchased recently for this room, then you can check out my vlog channel and subscribe if you would like to. And I think that's pretty much all I wanted to say. Okay, so I'm just going to get into the haul and I want to show you what I got from the Louis Vuitton store. It came in a little bag like this. And I'm very, very I guess conservative when it comes to big purchases like this. I really like to save my money and see my savings account grow and grow and this was definitely something that I've been wanting for over two years and I figured because this is how I justified the purchase because I've been wanting it for over two years and my mind hasn't changed at all and usually my mind, my mind changes, changes very quickly like I'll buy something and a couple months later I won't really like it as much anymore so because I was spending the money on this I thought I have wanted it for two years I'm not going to get sick of it, so that's kind of how I justify spending the money on it. So I just went ahead and got it. Honestly, just makes me like really, really happy to look at it and to hold it, and it's just something that I thought I would never have, and now I have it, so it's really exciting for me. So it, it came in a box like this with like a leather tie around it, which I'm not sure why they put a leather tie because it comes in a pullout like this, and I've had this for like about a week, so I've already used it. It is a new wallet, and I absolutely love this wallet. It's just... Every color on it, I can think of like a nail polish color that is like similar. I know that's so weird, but it just makes me happy. It's almost like if candy could be in a wallet or a wallet could be like a piece of candy, this would be it. I love all of the colors and I especially love the inside because it's like a bubblegum pink and I had all of, my, all of my credit cards on this side, but I took them out just for the video. But I have my change in this zipper and some other things down here. And these are all of my like store cards like Ulta and Sephora and the beauty store and my uh, Starbucks gold card and things like that and I just love the inside so much and there's space down here as well and like I said my change is in this zipper and then when you snap it closed when, it, when it's closed I like to keep my like gift cards and things in here because I always seem to have gift cards to places so I love that as well and it's just it reminds me of like candy it's just I think I've said that a hundred times but it's just so beautiful and I'm so excited about it and it's just my new baby. I'm just completely in love with this and I couldn't be happier and it makes me so happy to pull it out of my purse and to buy a pack of gum because I get to stare at this. And, and it's funny because the actual purses that come in this print I don't like at all. I think they're kind of like not tacky but I would never purchase them because they wouldn't really go with a lot of things that you wear and in purse form I guess it's a little bit tacky but in wallet form like no one's gonna see this besides me when I pull it out of my purse and I just, I absolutely love it. It's the prettiest thing ever. So I've had the same wallet ever since like I started carrying wallets. So it's a nice change and I'm really excited about it. So next I went to my local beauty store. It's called Cosmoprof and you do have to have like your professional cosmetology license to shop there and you get a big discount on the products and stuff. So that is where I get a lot of my nail polish and I get questions about where I purchase my nail polish all the time. Okay, so I'm going to start with the nail polish. I did get a couple colors from the brand new um, China Glaze Sensational Collection, which is like their new um, like summer neon collection, and all of the colors are so beautiful. But I fell in love with three. I'm wearing two of them today, actually. My absolute favorite one is called Highlight of My Summer, and it's this green color that I'm wearing. These are all neon, but like really creamy and pretty, and in my opinion, China Glaze has the prettiest neons, and the most... Uh, 
color selections of neon polishes. Yeah, but it's on my nails right now, and it's just like a really, really pretty minty cream neon polish, and I absolutely love it. And if you didn't notice, I kind of painted my nails today to match my new wallet because I'm just weird like that. Next color I got, though, is called Bottoms Up, and it's a really pretty bubblegum pink neon color. Very, very pretty. The only color that I have similar to it is this one, which is called Shocking Pink, and it's a little bit darker. So this one's more of like a bubblegum pink, which I like that a lot. Then I got two Yacht to Handle, which is a beautiful turquoise neon color. And then I got this OPI one, which is actually from an older collection, but they had it in stock, and it's called I Don't Give a Rotterdam, and it's a really pretty, like, gray-purple, but it has little flecks of gold glitter in it, so I thought that was really pretty. And then I got a polish from a brand that I'd never heard of before. The brand is Morgan Taylor, and the polish is called It's My Party. It totally reminds me of Miley Cyrus's new song, which I'm obsessed with, but it's pretty because it's a multicolored glitter, like a birthday kind of confetti glitter, but there's a ton of pink and rose gold in it, which I thought was just like, which I just thought was like the prettiest thing ever. So I cannot wait to wear this. It has like a lot of like baby pinks and baby blues in it. I just thought it was like a very unique glitter and I wanted to try this brand as well. Okay, the only other things I got from the beauty store are kind of boring because I've shown them in videos before, but I bought a pack of my favorite lashes, which are the Ar Ardell Demi Pixie Lashes. And then I got two of these, which one is already in my shower. Um, it's the All Soft Heavy Cream. I put this in a favorites video recently, but it was buy two, get one free off the Redken stuff. So I bought two of the heavy creams and then one more of my Powder Refresh Dry Shampoo, which is my favorite dry shampoo. So I just kind of stocked up on that, and that is all I got at the beauty store. So I'm going to quickly show you guys what I got in my Ipsy bag this month because it was an amazing bag. If you have no idea what it is, I will link it down below. It's $10 a month and you get a brand new actual makeup bag in the mail every single month filled with some beauty products to try out. And, I'll, and it's like way over the $10 value, so it's awesome. And the main reason I love it the most out of all the other ones is because you get an actual makeup bag every month, a new one, and instead sort of like a cardboard box that you just toss, so it's awesome. So the first thing I got, which I almost purchased myself the other day at Ulta, is this Pop Beauty um, Coral Crush. It's just like a lipstick, lip balm, more of a lip balm because it's not super like uh, pigmented. Um, I put some on. Super, super pretty. Like I said, it's the shade Coral Crush, and I almost bought this um, at Ulta the other day because Pop Beauty makes one of my all-time favorite nail polish colors in the shade Mint Magic, which is the green I used in my Rufian manicure with the glitter, and also the green color that I used in my Dreamcatcher nail art tutorial, and it's one of the prettiest mint green colors ever. And when I was in the Pop Beauty section, I saw these, and they were like, I think over $25, $23, something like that. So already this is like double the cost of the Ipsy bag for the month, and I really, really like this color, so super excited about that. Okay, then I got something that I'm actually wearing today on my eyes. It's this little BH Cosmetics California Collection Eyeshadow Trio Palette, and basically they give you one eyeshadow from each of their um, little palettes up here, so they give you like one from each palette if you want to actually purchase those palettes, and I actually do. I've never used BH Cosmetics eyeshadows before, and I was so surprised about how pigmented they were because I have tried some other brands that make a lot of the really large eyeshadow palettes and the pigmentation is just not good at all. But I'm wearing this Malibu shade on my lids today and it's really, really pigmented. I had no idea that BH Cosmetics was that pigmented. I haven't used the purple yet. It's the only one I haven't used. Next I got this so Sexy Hair Soy Renewal Beach Spray and it's like a little mini size but it's a huge size even though it's like the travel size. And I absolutely love this stuff. I actually have the full size or full size version myself. It's really awesome. I'm excited that I have the mini one because if you're ever going to the pool or the beach or wherever and you get out of the pool and your hair is still wet, spray this in it because it's just like getting out of the shower and your hair is wet. Spray this in it and you get really cool texture in your hair. It like kind of takes the frizz away and gives you more of like a wave and stuff. So this stuff is awesome. Super excited that it was in my Ipsy bag and I love it. I love it a lot. Okay, so the next thing I got is a nail polish. It's a nail teeny. This is on my toes right now. I had never used the nail teeny brand before. The um, formula of this particular color, which is called Mai Tai, was really nice and opaque. So I definitely want to see what other color options this brand offers and try some more out. Two more things. The um, Derma E Microdermabrasion Scrub. It came in a little pot like this. And honestly, my favorite thing about this is how it smells. It smells, it's a really creamy texture. It smells like a lemon cupcake. Like, 
it smells like vanilla-y, lemony, just like a lemon cake of some sort. And it's really nice on my skin. I was super scared to use this because my skin is so sensitive. Like if I even pluck my eyebrows, pop as it, anything, I get like, my skin will get like welty from like disturbing it. It's really weird. Um, so I was excited that this didn't like make me have any kind of rash or break out or anything like that because I get really nervous when it comes to scrubs. So I definitely want to check out this um, full size version and see what else the brand offers because I had never heard of it before. This thing I got, which I do want to try the full size version because I like it that much, is the Kula brand Mineral Sunscreen Tinted Moisturizer. It's an organic sunscreen that is also um, tinted. So you're not going to get like a white cast in pictures. Normally use the Neutrogena, the uh, baby one, because that's like the only sunscreen at the drugstore that has natural um, sun protectant but this one does too and it's organic so I want to try this for like see if they have like a body version and get the full size face version so that is everything that I got in my Ipsy bag I thought that was awesome for $10 so I will put the link below if you want to check it out and that is pretty much it so I hope that you enjoyed the video. It's just a very quick haul video, something different from a tutorial. I do want to do some tags. If there's any tags going around that you want to see me do, let me know in the comments. I also want to start doing a question and answer series over on my vlog channel. Like, I was thinking of calling it Just Jen, like Q&A. Yeah, so if you want to see something like that, go leave me questions on my home decor haul on that channel. That way I can write them all down and then actually do one of those videos for you. And let me know if you think the name Just Jen is a good title for that I'm not sure but I couldn't think of anything else but anyway I hope that you enjoyed the video I will be back with I have a makeup haul that I want to do I just have to purchase a couple more things because I have things on my list that Sephora was out of so I might order them online or go back and see if they have it in stock so a makeup haul like a large collective makeup haul will definitely be coming soon and I think that's pretty much it I want to do some tags I haven't done a tag in like a year so well I did one on my vlog channel a couple months ago but on this channel it's been like over a year and I'm totally blabbing right now so I hope that you enjoyed the video give it a thumbs up if you want to see more haul videos I guess and I love you guys thank you for watching and subscribing and I will see you soon bye